Imagine an AI assistant that can caption videos, translate speech in real time, solve visual puzzles and even invent games by looking at a world map. Google's newly launched Gemini model can do all of this and more with its groundbreaking multimodal capabilities. While AI models like ChatGPT focus only on language, Gemini seamlessly combines understanding across text, images, audio and visual, much more aligned with human cognition. Beyond its versatile sensory perception, Gemini also reasons more contextually and casually about real-world concepts. This helps it caption a baby ostrich video appropriately as cute and clumsy rather than just describing motionless objects. Or invent a geography guessing game by associating emoji clues with countries on a map. Remarkably, Google benchmarked its mighty Gemini against OpenAI's powerful GPT-4 model and found it surpasses on 30 out of 32 tests. But as experts wisely caution, real-world usage will expose Gemini's true capabilities and limitations much more meaningfully. As three unique versions of Gemini start empowering products like Google's Bard chatbot and Pixel Phone keyboard, their impact promises to catalyze an AI-first era for Google after feeling disrupted by ChatGPT's meteoric rise in popularity last year. Much like how the browser wars between Netscape and Internet Explorer in the 90s accelerated the growth of commercial internet, the mighty Gemini Ultra excels at complex reasoning tasks in data centers. Gemini Pro brings versatile and intelligence to scale across Google's consumer products and Petite Gemini Nano enables efficient on-device smarts. Together, they aim to permeate Google's universe of users with radically intuitive AI experiences, whether summarizing content, translating languages, or composing emails. But in unleashing ultra-potent models to the public, responsible development remains vital. Google undertook extensive testing to instill safety in Gemini, while launching programs that help other developers build ethical AI too. As opportunities in healthcare, education and sustainability beckon, policies balancing benefits and risks remain crucial as Gemini rolls out. Well, Google emphasizes Gemini underwent safety testing at an unprecedented scale, both internally screening over 3 million English sentences to expose problematic tendencies, and externally allowing 80 independent researchers to stress test and audit its behaviors. These tests help construct Gemini's moral compass before it's integrated across Google Search, online ads, YouTube, and more to impact billions of lives. But as Microsoft's 2022 Tay fiasco showed, even extensively trained AI can spiral out of control once exposed to humanity's uglier sides. So risks remain as Gemini hits public hands next week. And this is just about software, but the world is also witnessing a war of robots between the US and China. So if you want to learn who is leading with AI robots, then do watch the video on our channel. Coming back, to promote responsible AI development, Google also announced funds supporting related research and startups. And get this, they are even launching an independent advisory committee with ethicists like Dr. Joanna Bryson. Bryson will guide Google on thorny challenges like bias in AI. Google knows living up to its do-no-evil mantra requires continuous collaboration between technology, policy, and society. Now, while Google locks horns with OpenAI in an escalating AI arms race, ironically both share a common vision. We've only scratched the surface of AI's potential. OpenAI CEO Sam Altman himself said that giant AI models are at the end of an era. What lurks over the horizon? Altman believes more advanced intelligence could emerge from combinations of today's neural networks, symbolic logic, and reasoning systems. Google's CEO, Sundar Pichai, also underscored his ambition for AI to gain more reasoning capabilities leading to breakthroughs in complex domains like robotics and quantum computing. Think self-driving cars that can argue about philosophy or intelligent assistants that can understand a baby's inaudible speech. However, this also spotlights areas requiring continuous safety research. For instance, Gemini Ultra, which promises even more mighty reasoning abilities, will remain in controlled beta throughout 2023 to rigorously assess risks. Similar to medical trials, this enables Google to isolately study capabilities and weaknesses before being responsible for wider rollouts. Google is also launching developer programs helping technologists build AI responsibly across industries like healthcare and education. 
Imagine AI-generated personalized learning plans that transform how we teach future generations. Our predictive algorithms support doctors to cure previously uncurable diseases. The tech visionary Roy Amara's famous adage goes, We tend to overestimate the effect of technology in the short run, but underestimate it in the long run. Perhaps in the long arc of human history, we will view today's breakthroughs as just baby steps towards more wondrous artificially intelligent worlds. Google cementing its footing again at the frontiers of AI technology through arduous research focused on safety and responsibility certainly seeds optimism. Now over to you, dear developer. How will you harness Gemini's might to conjure innovative magic while advocating for thoughtful progress? Your answers may guide what awaits in AI's next era. As Gemini materializes across our laptops and smartphones, reactions from AI luminaries signal cautious optimism. They praise Google's engineering feats advancing multimodal AI to help humans, like using Gemini's computer vision to narrate images for the blind or transcribe doctor's voice notes to text. But concerns echo about inevitable misapplications. As algorithms grow uncannily skilled at generating any media, how do we build guardrails against deepfakes weaponizing misinformation? As AI becomes the ultimate machine teacher and content creator, how do we reskill workforces for disrupted jobs? As flaws in massive neural networks inevitably surface, how can we best support agile and ethical AI development? All crucial questions require ongoing public debate. Nonetheless, Gemini heralds an inflection point after a watershed year for AI permeating mainstream consciousness. Much like the explosive Cambrian era breeding complex life forms on our premodoral planet, 2022's ChatGPT sparks set off a Cambrian explosive of creative human applications experimenting with generative AI powers. Now in 2023, Google's Gemini strikes back to reshape what AI can accomplish and how we may utilize it. News headlines will hype this as tech giants dueling for AI dominance, but fundamentally, intense competition incubating ambitious ideas is exactly how breakthrough technologies like AI thrive as both Google and OpenAI recognize. Ultimately, as AI capabilities advance, companies and governments must also evolve policies balancing the pace of progress with ethical responsibility. Getting this right unlocks the upside for human empowerment while mitigating downside risks. So, though Gemini opens exciting new frontiers, wisdom cautions advances best serve societies when pursued carefully. The quest to develop AI guardrails while maximizing benefits now falls to all of us, from software school grads, graduation sound, to policymakers in world capitals. Today's breakthrough models like Gemini are merely precursors to more disruptive AI technologies inevitably unfolding through the century ahead, like self-improving algorithms. Our collective decisions now profoundly impact what capabilities and risks emerge next from AI's magical cauldron.